Okay guys, it is not even 6 a.m. now, but I have arrived at Ernschatz Week. And now I'm so happy that my landlord is picking me up. But I will definitely go back to bed <laughs> for at least one or two hours. I really did not sleep well, but yeah, more on that later. <sighs> Okay, guys, it is now already after 6 p.m. My Sunday is basically over and I can just tell you it was very, very relaxing. So when I came home, I got, like I said, I got picked up by my landlord. I actually went back to bed, as I said, and was, yeah, laying around for a bit. I was not really sleeping, I think. I kind of um, fell into a light sleep for like 30 minutes, something like that. And then I woke up at 7.30. So that was then also the time when I started listening to music and slowly like, yeah, relax already. And after that, well, I really felt this whole day like I don't want to do anything. So I was laying on the couch watching some videos and then I felt like okay hmm, now I want to do this but I don't have the energy to do it and then I was like in this oh, okay I want to eat something but I don't have the energy to do something so it was really like oh and well actually we went to the grocery store today so I even bought something there so I got a lot of snacks and I was like eating chips and it was definitely not the healthiest day so far. And yeah, besides this, I continued recording a lot of videos and also um, cutting videos. So for example, the one that's coming up tomorrow. Uh, not tomorrow, wait, <laughs> for me tomorrow, I'm sorry. The one that is coming, that came yesterday for you guys. And yeah, so... I'm now making making some dinner but to give a summary on the night train situation I really really can tell you if you have the opportunity to buy a sleeping department for a good price go for it even if you are maybe alone it is still something that you can just um take a positive out of this like the only negative that you can experience is that you have a not so good night maybe because people are snoring or people are just liking to talk to you and that is i think the most negative because now in my um compartment that's the word that i was looking for this morning or yesterday Actually, in this compartment, it was impossible to fall asleep. In the beginning, the, the light in this yeah, train, the light in this train was so bright um, that, like, of course, people can probably sleep when they are really, really tired, but I always need that silence. Basically, no light, at least if it's natural. And yeah so i started like throwing my jacket over my face and using it as a pillow and as a cover because i don't i didn't have any pillow like it, it was it was a normal seat it was very very hard laying to the side so i was sleeping basically on the table with my head and yeah so i think i got sleeping hours because i i had the same skipping of time when you like wake up and you look at the time and you're like oh yeah one hour later and <laughs> but will i ever take that train again or will i maybe spend more money to be earlier in earnshaw's week unless it's a night train with a sleeping compartment i don't think so i really don't think i will do that one more time because it is really really uncomfortable ah no no maybe when i'm with friends maybe that's something different but not alone 
I really don't want to do that again. <sighs> I'm so sorry for yawning all the time, but already like this morning when I saw my bed, I was like, oh yes, <laughs> one hour in this thing. It felt so good to be back and I'm also looking forward to go to bed today. So right now I will yeah start cooking. I will make some shet bular with some rice and I don't know maybe some vegetables. And after that I will take a shower and then I will go straight to bed. And that is the plan for today. So unfortunately probably I was talking a lot of chaos in this video. I'm sorry for that. But sleep deprivation Oh, sorry, sleep deprivation definitely has control over me and my thinking procedures. <laughs> okay, so I hope you had a wonderful day. We will see each other tomorrow. Bye-bye.